Saturday's annual Kansas football spring game provided fans with their first look at the 2013 Jayhawks. Head coach Charlie Weiss is entering his second season at Kansas and already likes what he's seeing from his team so far this spring. We have better players, you know, we have, we have you know, better talent, we have better competition. We're, hopefully we're coaching better because part of the problem when, you're, when you don't do too well as the coaching isn't so hot either. Weiss says junior Tony Pearson will be used in many different formations on the offensive side of the ball this season. We'll see him out of the backfield, in the slot, and even lined up as a receiver. When he gets the ball in the open field, he's an explosive player that can create a world of problems for opposing defenses. The Jayhawks will return their top three leading rushers from last season, James Sims, Taylor Cox, and Tony Pearson. Ball carrier number 29, And Sims. wide receiver, Jake Heaps and Justin McKay, who could be the ones to make the real impact on the offensive end. Heaps went 20 for 28 for 287 yards and four touchdowns to lead the blue team to a 34-7 victory over the white team. McKay was the game's leading receiver with 99 yards on eight receptions and a touchdown. He also had one of the game's biggest highlights, a 47-yard one-handed catch down the left sideline on a beautifully thrown ball from Heaps. Last season, Kansas wide receivers had zero touchdown receptions, so it was nice to see McKay and other senior receiver Josh Ford find the end zone on Saturday. Justin has a little bit of an advantage because he's been hanging out with Jake for quite some time now. And I keep on, you know, you don't, you, you can't underestimate chemistry. You know, they were on a show team together all last year. The running game that averaged more than 210 yards per game last season picked up right where it left off as senior halfback James Sims rushed for 74 yards on 16 carries. Pearson picked up 32 yards and junior halfback Brandon Bourbon added 33. The team gets a few weeks off now until summer workouts start and the regular season kicks off at home against South Dakota on September 7th. Matt Gasper, KUJH TV Sports.